What's up guys, Matt there, Master Battles. Today we've got the quarterfinals, the first battle, or round three, whatever you want to call it. We have Ethereal Leon with Earth Leon, 145 BS. He knocked out, um, it was Lime Sergeant Mayo, and they knocked out Helio Z. And then he's going to be facing Hoppity Hop, who knocked out, uh, I'm doing this off the top of my head. I think it was an exotic mob, and then he knocked out me. So, I'll launch in Hoppy Hop first because he's got BD. This is going to be a tough one for Ethereal. I think there's a chance, kind of like in the Helio match, you know, Helio um, can destabilize from above. I think there's a chance if he starts to go off balance with BS, he can get under BD a bit. But it's going to be a tough one because Flame is, believe it or not, um, Flame is actually only like 0.7 grams lighter than earth or 0.5 or something i think it's 0.7 it's one of the uh, earth is 33.2 grams or something 0.1 grams uh flames actually 32.5 and most things the vulcan i know is above 32 most things are below 32 though so flame is one of the heavier wheels but there's thought that you know sometimes earth could suck the salmon out i know that was a brought up with uh, sumo but sumo uh eat earth ds so that was not the case that means the BS can also destabilize and just fall off balance, too. That's the other thing. So this is going to be close. And Life After Death is going to get a top to hop. Well, okay. Redoing that. <laughs> that was bad. And... So Hoppy Dop definitely has the advantage here as we saw. Uh, won that first one, and it does not give much hope for Ethereal, because it's gonna be hard. If he couldn't win there, which seemed to be kind of favorable and got Hoppy Dop off balance, then it's gonna be hard for him to win. But we will see, never know. I think one thing I do like here is I think it's pretty much everybody has a chance. Though, um, I thought, I thought, I thought BD was a little bit taller, that, um, Ethereal might be able to get under him quicker, slash easier. Ooh, that's how he is. Oh, that's how he is. Will Ethereal get stabilized at the end or not? He will not. So, yeah. As I was going to say, I think that this is a very, um... I think everybody has a chance here. This match could go either way. So we were I was wrong on this early in that last match. I was like, okay, maybe Ethereal doesn't have a chance. Ethereal has a great chance. And so does Hoppity Hop. The next match we've got Dollar Bill versus Sumo. Um Medio is not really known for attack, it's you know, known for absorbing and spin stealing. But he's in a bracket with a bunch of stamina base. And he's facing Sumo, he's got duo and MB. So he could very well, get the knockout, but he also could not get the knockout in sumo with one. Um, we've got Iron Spider versus Luke Pearson. Scythe Aquario D125 CS and Beat Aquila 100 R squared off. Or actually, this is a leftover flat. Oh, and. If after death again, Hoppy Hop's gonna take it. So it's 2 1 Hoppy Hop. Um, you know, it's, I don't know how size defense is. This is CS, it's an old, it's a warrant CS, so I'm also not sure how much you know. I don't know with the, the slope of the stadium with the big knock close to the ridge, you know, how much the rubber ends up hitting. But CS is still defensive. That's one thing I've always wondered with CS is, how much when it gets worn down and the plastic's really what shows, you know, how much defense does end up having. Because, you know, the ones that throw are really high are aggressive, you know, which I guess you have defense, but you also are, you know, basically an attack game. Um, but could he survive Aquila? Maybe. Maybe he has a good amount of defense and Aquila can't get KO. And then, uh, Mr. Weakwall, with his gravity destroyer D125R squared off and Griff Aquila, who has burned, uh, Aquila, 90 CS with an aggressive CS. And... It's 
gonna be ethereal. Um, you know, burn is a pretty low bay. It does a CS, but it's still pretty low bay. Gravity does hang down though. Burn's got low defense, but CS has good stamina, or has good defense. So, this will be interesting. I think really any match can go either way. Attack battles can always go either way. Um, but even the more stamina based ones, you know, like this one, it's 2 2. And this is going to be just as long as if I had two battles in the video. Daryl's losing some stamina here. But it looks like Hoppity Hop is also losing stamina. Oh man, this is gonna come down to the wire. And ooh, ooh, this is gonna be close. Hoppity Hop is gonna win just barely with that life after death of BD. So Hoppity Hop is the first semi-finalist. Thank you, Ethereal Leon, for entering. You got seconds away from being the first semi-finalist. So uh, Hoppity Hop will be facing either GD Dollar Bill or Sumo, and that'll be later today. So hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.